Pete. They were called Pete. Grandpa Pete, looking horse. He, but he died a long time ago. But he was really a good singer. He knew so many songs from around here, and he knew that I liked to do the flute music. So then, uh, years ago, back when he was a little boy, they uh, they had flute players around this area. I suppose this was over hundred years ago, and they had special songs. They're kind of like you guys ever celebrate Valentine's Day. You know what that is, Valentine's Day? Anybody heard of Valentine's Day? You heard of it? Yeah. <laughs> so in Valentine's Day, you can send Valentine's like maybe on a chocolate, or you can send like email. You can write a letter. You can send a make a phone call, send a card, or something like that. But see, way way back a long time ago, they didn't have all that stuff. So what they do is they send a Valentine on the wind. Isn't that interesting? On the wind. So a person would, uh, they would, uh, they want to send a valentine to their valentine sweetheart. They would find a place, like where they, wherever that valentine is, their person, and they'd check the lid, like that, and they'd figure out uh, to get on the uh, upwind from that person. So then they would play that flute and be with their wind behind, the, behind their back, and that wind would take it over to, see? You see what I'm saying? How they send it? So I'll give you an example of a Valentine song from from, from like Cannonball for Eating. <laughs> Yeah. They've listened to a lot 